Can you tell us, can you share with us again the benefits of, um, of why you think it's better for us to own this particular piece of property at know. those numbers? Like what, what are the benefits that over the lease option? I mean, we get ownership, Certainly. so we get to depreciate it or? You're, 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 forget all that. I mean, yes, Blair can address that, but certainty from my standpoint, you have legal certainty. You know what you're getting and you know what you got. Mm -hmm. And there's not going to be any potential surprises coming at you out of the sun down the road. That which can happen. It's happened all the time. <clears throat> I mean, we haven't even addressed what, you know, we used to call sellers greed glands. I've had guys stiff me at the closing table on sandwich leases when the market was rising. Now it's not the case now, but it doesn't mean it couldn't happen. <clears throat> All of a sudden we go to close and the seller's like, I want more money. You're gonna make more money because the value of the house has gone up. So I want another $5,000. Happened to me a dozen times in my career. And what are you gonna do? They're, they got you over the barrel to closing table. If you don't pay it, you're not getting the deed. You can sue them, but nobody wins in that deal. Right. Except for the attorney. If you get the deed, you're done. You own it. It's all on you. Okay. And you literally own yourself a house in Florida. <laughs>